All right, so um, I'm actually here with some clients right now. We're here in the uh, the ridges, which is actually exclusive a neighborhood. And um, today we are touring a 2.4 million dollar home, and this one's about 4,100 square feet. Look how gorgeous this kitchen is. Definitely to die for. Now, this builder was actually a uh, William Lyon Homes, but they no longer exist. But man, one one of the cool things about you know, becoming a real estate agent, I get to take a look at these gorgeous homes. Now these homes are pretty much tight. You don't have like big backyards. However, you are in one of the exclusive neighborhoods here. Now look at that pivot door. So here is a suite for the mother-in-law, which is perfect. Love this uh, linear windows here. Nice catwalk. Oh, take a look at this. The owner suite. Wow. Love this dual fireplace. Hit this uh, patio right here, overlooking the pool. Let's take a look at the spa. I got a closet here built in. Got another one here. Oh wow. Very clean. Very clean and elegant. All right, so I forgot to show you the front of the home. So this is actually the home that we just toured here. So uh, this property, the asking price is 1.6 million. It's 4,200 square feet, four bedrooms, and, and also a loft. All right. All plans start to the silk of this transaction. So keep in mind that some of these uh, neighborhoods will have a balance of six and lives to it. Like this one has a balance of 2600 Okay. Once it's paid off, you no longer have to make that payment. But that is a balance. You're going to get that a lot here in the Summerland area. So tell me how that works again. Did they so, owe some money to Yeah, them? so basically what happens is uh, sits and lives stands for Land Improvement District. Right? Uh, what did I say? Uh, SIDS and LIDS in uh, special improvement districts. Uh, what that means is, like, some of them, they buy pieces of dirt, like you see them stretching. They will break up the parcels, and what happens is they have to pay the county for the bond. So basically, what happens is, now they have to pay for the county, they come back out, put in the sewer line, put all that in. So let's just say the bond is like $30 million. You have like hundreds and hundreds of parcels. So the builder passes that fee off to the buyer. So like this parcel has a balance of 13,000, right? And let's just say you buy this property, this 10,000, you make an annual payment of $1,000 a year, right? Until it's paid off. If you sell the home, that gets passed off to the next buyer. So the balance on here is 2,600 bucks. Right? The annual here is eight hundred thirty-nine dollars. Okay. Or you can just at the close of that scroll say, "Yeah, just paid off." So that way you don't have to have an extra bill. Yeah. So that's an option. Or you can always negotiate and have the seller, you know, pay for it however you want. Here's that pool table he's talking about. Yeah. Well, the the lights are turned off, but also uh, all your finishings are dark, and that's the reason why it looks like this. But you could definitely lighten it up for sure. Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely like the other one better. This one is more open. Yeah. Right? But the other one, you're paying more for a location. Okay. I mean, this is a great location too, but I mean, I like the other one. It's all different styles and taste. That taste difference is about a mil. That's true. Now you can really taste it. <laughs> all right, so it looks like we got the kitchen here. Got the den here, 
nice large loft up there. Your primary up there too as well. And oh, the primary is actually down here. It looks like. Let's see here, man. It is a little bit dark. I'm not liking this one. I am not liking this one whatsoever. I think the first one is the way to go. Oh, believe it or not, this is the couch from RC Willys. I've always wanted this couch right here. Now we're in the Southwest and we're taking a look at these uh, Peter Lick models here, as you can see. Lindsay, Steve, this is Andy. Michelle? Hi, Andy, how are you? I'm Lindsay. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Hi. Hi, I'm Steve. This this is nice Steve to meet Lynn. you. Wow, take a look at the front here. It's gorgeous. So I wanted us to start in this home. So number one, it's the air conditioning's on in here. This so one's done um, mm -hmm. just as of Friday. It was just completed. Uh, this is the last home in this subdivision that we have that's available. So if you're looking for something for a media occupancy, this would be um, the best option. Um, in total, we have about 96 of these homes that we're going to be building the overall project. Um, this wow. is phase two of that project, so this was an eight month home attack. And we're just uh, graining the land just, just across the street and kind of pretty corner from here for the next phase, which is a 23 home unit subdivision. So, depending on what your timing is, if this home is a little bit, the next batch of homes that we're able to deliver will be late summer next year. Um, we're, we're in for permits on the, the first eight homes there uh, that you can select from one of those, and then they will be ready to process them later after we get our permits. Pretty dope home. There's a uh, well, just a uh, shutter system that they designed here for uh, the exterior so that if you want to open the pocket doors and have the fresh air but close the shutters, you have uh, privacy and shade, but you can still have the fresh air having the door open. And that's just on a remote so you can click the button and do that as you need it. <laughs> it's so unique, I love that. Yeah, that's really cool. Oh, you got a little peekaboo strip view, huh? Yeah, south end of the strip. So here's uh, one of the uh, guest bedrooms. Look at this, you got a beautiful zero threshold. And look at this, just stonework. This is just gorgeous. Man, this guy Peter Lick, he does a very good job. Take a look at that, that back lip on this. What a bathroom. Pretty dope, huh? Take a couple pictures here real quick. Night and create beautiful shadows. Um, that's kind of the, the wow of this house. Wow, this is gorgeous. And then you've got a much um, bigger, you know, sort of all-in-one break room down here, most living, dining, and um, This is an example of what's called the extended kitchen. This is a little bit I definitely really love the colors on this. You got the rustic um, with the black look. This is a much more bold style with the black slab, the black handles, and the black cabinets. Um, and then they opened up the entry up over there and did kind of a locker style entry to add that format texture. So the regular kitchen ends about uh, right here, um, and then this island is sort of this way, and you have full height cabinets with like your fridge and stuff over that way. So you still keep your triangle, but it just kind of turns this way short term and it makes the, the living area much bigger. I'm telling you, this home looks like a museum right now. You got level five finishings on here. You got nice windows from like floor to ceiling. This is a hallway that literally takes you out into your primary bedroom. I mean, look at this. You got this piece of nice uh, stonework right here. And I noticed with this uh, Peter Lick stuff, everything that you see in here, it's kind of like the dark, the modern, the rustic. You got the blacks, the browns, the grays. I mean, this thing is just unbelievable. Look, man, I gotta get my game up. Like, seriously. All right, let's go take a look at this uh, bathroom right here. So here's the uh, primary. You got the 15 foot pocket doors overlooking the pool. You got a detached guest house over there. 
Yeah, yeah it's, it's almost special. like a garage door motor, but we're on. Um, we don't go away. We're going to be building in this general vicinity for the next 10 years. And, you know, we, um, Stand by your warranty. Yeah, we, you get a two year, a 210 warranty, two years, everything, 10 year structural, but you can talk to any of our customers. If you buy something from us, oh, wow. you want people to move in or they're putting in your speakers and they count wrong. You can literally take a sh shower outside. We, we would much prefer we're boutique. This is crazy. I like this. You can take a shower outside. Isn't it amazing? Yeah, I don't know if that's a good idea for me or not, but <laughs> kids be hopping the wall. Look at this. Your neighbor's already looking on top of the roof. Well, I don't know about that. You gotta be on the roof. <laughs> wow, this is gorgeous. Now this is one of the most gorgeous backyards I've ever seen. Uh, we are right now in the Southern Highlands mass plant community. Uh, this home right here is a 2.2 million, about 4,700 uh, square feet. I believe this home is actually William Line Homes. I think. I, I think, feel like it is. I think that's what it is. Mm. I can find out exactly, and I'll text. Oh, don't worry, Bob. I'm just curious. Yeah, this stone uh, was. I got a built-in refrigerator. Bosch appliances. All right, so the good news is that I literally just got a call from one of my offers for 2.4, and we just got that accepted, so that's a good deal. Good news today, but let's take a look at the rest of this house. I love this chandelier. Makes you want to jump on it. <laughs> <laughs> this has got to be a William Line Homes. I think it is. Yeah, I think it is too. So what Richard was saying is two guest bedrooms here. I guess there's like a little... What is that over there? This front balcony. Oh, front balcony. Oh, is that connected to that too? Oh, that's yes. pretty cool. Beautiful loft, but this is gorgeous right here. It's gorgeous, right? Yeah, I believe these are called Tudor style homes. Tudor. All right, so this is it. You okay if we take some pictures, right? Yeah, that's totally okay. This is from Lake Las Vegas magazine. Wow, look at this. Look at this view. I like those homes right over there. Um, and it's totally like, um, is it okay that we wear shoes or yeah, yeah, booties? Yeah, that's mine out here. All right, let's take a look at this thing. Yeah, we're almost at check-in here as well. All of this is new and they put in the outdoor kitchen, so that's all brand new. system so it's not tied to any company but it's an alarm system or ring doorbell one inside at your front door and then one right outside the gates well there's your office andy yeah this is a gorgeous view because when you're up here you get some of the green from the, the sports club and it's a really nice patio all right well that's uh pretty much it for this uh video vlog if you guys want to um check out the homes that we've been uh, touring today i'm gonna have a link in the uh, description with all the homes that we toured i want you guys to check out all the homes i think we had what a total of seven homes that we viewed let me know which one did you guys like the best all right other than that until next time peace